G'day everybody, and welcome back for some more RimWorld with Catback and dinosaurs and eaten limbs. And thousands of Comsognathus. Yeah, hopefully they're going to be doing eating of other and of our enemies' limbs. Because they're kind of... They're kind of mean. I've been playing some solo stuff with the dino mod and... Compies in a group, when they're hunting one of your colonists, are really difficult. Because they're quick, and they're little, so they're hard to hit. Hey, three years dragged on. Thanks for a sub. Oh, I don't know if Capac's channel. Where is Capac's channel? It's weird to think it's been so long. Hey. Dragged on sub shortly before all the COVID shenanigans. Back when we had dreams of what we were going to do with an office. Do you remember that time, Capac? How uh, innocent didn't we were. Never happened. <laughs> How much is Esther going to go bananas with her Alzheimer's? I'm going to say seven. Other than building the extra bit of the base, were there other plans we had? Uh, um, uh, yeah, I was going to start working on plumbing because we just got plumbing. Uh-huh. Uh, so I'm going to have to have a look at what's available. Well, we'll probably want to wait until we've got um, the bedrooms built before we start doing anything on the plumbing anyway because we're going to need to get a lot of this stuff constructed and are we out of wood is that why no one's building anything no we've got wood let's see we got sewage outlet oh uh what a well hmm Neil is doing all the growing. Kajada should be Tom? building once the cooking is done for the day. Hmm. Basin. Okay, there's a little bit more built. Um, oh, uh, hang on. Ah. There you go, Kamak. Accept the squad stream invite. So people can watch both uh, if they want. Uh, okay. I've done that in a while. Hasn't felt as necessary for RimWorld because it's kind of we do look at a lot of the same stuff. Well, it's not working anyway. Yeah, oh, delightful. Oh well, forget about that then. <laughs> um, Mara, I'm not oh, sure how go. the counting works with squad stream thing. What, ah. now, now it's working. I just closed it. Why is this storm so noisy? I'm gonna, I'm gonna start squad stream. There we go. I already accepted it. Yeah, but I have to then click start once you accept it. How's Woolerton going? So... Woolerton and Asta oh. both missing limbs. That's right. Probably want a water tower. Oh no, don't start ordering it up yet, Kamak. 
because we want to move things first. Like, we're rearranging buildings, we're moving bedrooms, we're doing all that stuff. Wait, wait till the bedrooms are moved. And but then... I, I already know what's happening with the plumbing. How? When you don't know what we're going to do with the rooms that are there. Because this is upstream, so we're getting water from here, and we're plumbing everything through that way, and offloading it downstream where the bedrooms are. I mean, upstream is wherever we put the well in. Because you got to put in a, a water well and a wind pump. Yeah. But so the, wouldn't the, that... The river is flowing... You, yeah, but wouldn't you be putting that up near the turbines then? Because that's where we've got wind. Also, one of the turbines is completely blocked what by... The, where did that get there? A meteorite. <laughs> That was that just landed. That was the limestone meteorite that just landed. Didn't even see that. Stupid meteorites. Uh alright, well where's the Mr. What what is going on here? I mean, Kachada, what are you doing? Oh, you're teaching. Why are you teaching? Because you're the only one who does child get. That's why no construction gets done. Uh, you... uh, just remember, you don't want the water towers somewhere where it's easy for our enemies to attack them either. So maybe put them somewhere safer than our fully exposed boundary. Because they take a while to fill, so you... that's just something to keep in mind. Um... I mean, we could start walling off the wind turbine area and I could put them up there. Yeah, or you could put them... Um, they can be inside as well. You could put them up with the batteries. If there's room there for digging out, like, you could dig these two blocks out and just put it up there. Um, Where all the power go out? So we have no power. Because we only have one turbine and it oh, doesn't right. produce enough. Of course. We should really be researching um, as soon as we can the water mill generators. So we can stick them on the creek. Why are we researching septic tanks? No, we probably don't need to. Change it if you like. Uh, uh, we could make a room for the uh, for the thermal generator down here. We could keep the water stuff in in that room. Oh, as in make it bigger, because we obviously aren't going to roof it. You could just make a bigger area yeah, and leave so space. If we yeah. Well, remember, the, the thing you've laid out is the size of the generator, not the size of the room. Is it? Yep. Oh, you just think you're putting a wall down? Like, if you just... Just put this wall down between the prison room and the current toilet room, and then yeah. you can just put stuff on the inside of that? Yeah, that could work. Oh, that limestone's going to take forever to get mined. <laughs> That's really annoying. I had uh, one of my solo saves where I had I was playing with vanilla events expanded, so sometimes you get multiple meteorites. They landed square in my fridge. Oof. Yeah, destroying my food, my roof, all of the stuff. It was so bad. 
remember why I got bored of that save, but it wasn't due to that. Uh, I think the wind turbine also took a chunk of damage. Oh yeah, it did. And Esther's confused. Delightful. Um, you could get rid of that miner quicker if you made Tatonga not do research as a priority over mining. Lord. Give people an excuse to visit the prisoner. See the prisoner go to the sauna. Mmm, prison sauna. Not sure that's enticing. Yuso's Protoceratops, a 35-year-old ascetic priest named Yuso, is calling from nearby. He says a pack of 21! What? <laughs> a man hunting Protoceratops are hunting him. He begs for safety. Um... You, Protoceratops are small. But 21? 21 is a lot. Um... Mechanoids land in my greenhouse on a tundra playthrough and wipe the colony. Oh, yeah. We do have eight of the Comsognathus can help by guarding somebody. Yeah, that's not... No. I, I. Sorry, buddy. I think you just... Your, your Protoceratops food, which is weird, because aren't they herbivorous? Yeah. Nasty beaks on them, though. learning still high. Good, good, good. Charter is slowly building the new bedrooms. Very slowly. Uh, I was going to have that outdoors, but I think I'm going to make that bit indoors. To try and get some cooling from fans in it. Oh, great. And Kachata's just broken, so no more construction for a bit. Apparently I was unhappy because I used a recreational drug. I mean, Kachata was. And want Walker Priesthood power. What do you... What? Ephedra? Why did you use Ephedra if it's going to make you unhappy? You ridiculous person. Also, you've got your hood. What else do you want? What's the other bit of apparel we need for our person? Oh, a cape. I see. Well, you've almost gotten the wind turbine back up to full functionality. Got power again. Kachada won't break again. How long does this affect? 2.6 days! A minus 15 debuff for... Gah. Don't... Ugh. Really? We got more of that stuff. What stuff? Ephedra. I don't know what that is. It is a drug of some sort that is from one of the plants around here. 
um, one of the normal generated plants, not something we're growing, uh, which means when we chop down a section of forest or clear a bit of land, they often harvest it. So it's a bit annoying. Capes are plus 10 to random superpowers. Mm. Uh, I probably should assign them to a no drugs policy. Yep, they are. I, what else can I do? Am I desynced? I honestly don't know what else <laughs> to do with this. What am I up to? Tending to Tweety. Oh, you got a bunch more to name. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> like, another nine? Uh, <laughs> Why is one of them called Mashed Potato Joe? Because it was meant to be Mashed Potato Johnson, but I ran out of letters. Uh huh. Well, at least the catharsis will cover me until the things run out, I think. Yep. Just need that cape to get made. Who's making the cape? Oh, brilliant. The same person is doing the cooking and the constructing. Uh, That's why everything's so slow. We've only got one person to do most of the important tasks. So what's the food doing over here? Pasta eating in the fridge. There's a table. Probably more comfortable in the fridge because it's cold, cooler. Uh, hmm. I'm trying to think what I can do to fix this up. It's just too much going on for one person to do it all. I don't think we want someone else taking over the cooking. It's doing the plants, which is important. No one else has tailoring skill. Hmm. Wonder if the storyteller will give us a new colonist, because we kind of need someone who can do some of these tasks. <laughs> it's a government construction colony, one worker, four supervisors. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. And if this kid would just grow up already, jeez. Yeah, good point. He's construction, isn't he? Um... He'll be... I mean, he's almost 11. He's only got another two years. Which is like... Two quadrums. Not a word. Uh, it is. It 
So he should be... What is it currently? Quadrum is four times the regular amount of rum. And why would you want that not to be a thing? Oh. The next day? Yeah, it wouldn't last very <laughs> long. Um, so he... He should Honest. be... He should be... Um, Adult by Rimworld standards by September. Oh yeah, thanks, Cross. I will change the stream info to Rimworld. Spelled Compsognathus. C O M P S O G N A T H. That's right. U S. Oh, that's not how you spell Rimworld, but it's fine. It worked anyway. Yes, yes, the Tinctoria doesn't like being under the roof, I know. Could. Let's pop a few little holes in the roof so that the Tinctoria doesn't die. Ah, so Kachata training Woolerton is kind of like um, an investment, hoping that we can train Woolerton to be a good enough builder that Kachata doesn't have to do any more building. But it is making our building really, really slow, and having Kapak go and add even more things is going to make it even slower again. Good. Our current research is water mill generator. Bunga up to seeking safe temperature. Yeah, seems reasonable since it's fifty nine degrees outside in the rain. Oh, yeah. I mean, he could just stand in front of the windmills. That'll cool him down. So, you're complaining about things not getting done because of me adding more stuff. So why have you added sculptures to the queue? What? What sculptures? A sculpture that I'm making at this bench. What? Those were added ages ago, and that's a separate person doing different things. It, Kachata doesn't do that stuff. I'm talking about our construction worker. Our one construction worker. Kamak didn't react to my future armor reference. I feel sad. Uh, it's real warm. I don't think these fans are cutting it. Compies, compies win. <laughs> Again. We might need to expand their range. Because I think we might have run out of um, things they can hunt.
Oh yay, it's cooled down to 40 degrees. It's an improvement. It's an improvement. It's still horrible, but it's an improvement. Yeah, and humidity would be at 100% too. Uh, so bad. Heat waves over, yay! Come back, keep an eye on the colony. I'm gonna go get myself a quick snack because I'm getting really hungry. What? I need food! Time to do all the things Splitsy doesn't want me doing. It's alright, I'll just undo them when I get back. It gives me something to do. Too late. Hey, Dunham, thanks for Prime Sub. Oh, the fridge is freezing things again. This is good news. It's like you guys need a volcanic winter. Yeah. If only the volcanic winter had worked. It didn't make anything cooler at all. Nobody's doing any falling. I was just hauling some corn. Now I'm playing billiards. Uh. Ah. Uh? Running out of Comsognathus sleeping spots. I'm not sure it matters. I think they'll just sleep wherever then. True, Graz. As long as we don't get a long night, it should be okay. I don't think we have the vanilla events expanded mod, though. Yeah, we don't. So in my, in my single player game, I've gotten a vanilla expanded event, which is a long night. A... An entity of gargantuan proportions has blocked out the sun and may not move on for months or years. Dear. I am already one year into no daylight. But I think I've found um, some fun settings for my next single-player RimWorld streams. I think I've got. I think I'm getting closer to dialing in the right level of difficulty to allow growth, but not just constant brutal stress. I was talking to Wasted about his uh, RimWorld experience on his current save. He's trying to do the quest where you have to bring three colonies up to a certain value 
which means you restart with people who have really high expectations. And he's just got gotten to a point where he's getting so constantly attacked and everything is just so hard that it's it's kind of stressful to think about again. <laughs> which I totally understand. I think he went back to it this week, though. And I, I don't want to get to that point. Future dad tip. RimWorld can be played single-handed with a programmable mouse, which works great when you have to feed or hold a kid. That's my 2,100 hours in RimWorld. Yeah, I think if I, I think if RimWorld existed back when I broke my hand, uh, I probably would have played it alongside the many, 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 many hours of uh, SimCity 4 that I played. Oh, Toucan died. Fight fighting a Wananasaurus. Now revenging. Uh, I don't like its <laughs> chances. Well, we're going to see a compy v compy battle. There's a herd of compies here. Or a pack. They could get nasty. Hmm. For them. Since there's only like six of them. Hmm. <laughs> There's so many of them. They'll be great for sending into battle. Because they do reproduce so quickly, we don't really have to worry if we lose a bunch. Easy for you to say. I'm not going to name them all. Hmm. <laughs> it keeps you busy. What's the best material to use for pipes? The cheapest one. Wood. Good old wooden pipes. I don't think there are any quality things with pipes. got a solid two weeks in on farming sim i'm hoping i i'm so annoyed that i didn't that i can't find time for games like farming sim and going back to some more station ears but <laughs> i i shouldn't be that annoyed because i still have a lot of time for playing a lot of games that i want to play there's a trader here well once i've finished teaching Woolerton about cooking i'll go talk to him Uh, hunters. Pachata intently gave an overview of egg varieties to Woolerton. Well, this scrambled. Shall I sell some compies? Oh, we need them. Yeah, maybe. 
I could sell them and buy a breeding pair of Dilophosaurs. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, all right, Flamingo, Jacobo, Fishy, Natasha, Bruce, Stephen, Wanda, Pepper, Peter, Gwen, Liz, Tony, Phoenix, Albatross, Sparkles, Dopey. I'm going to buy. Uh, can you see anything but... Can you see normal screen stuff at the moment, Kavak, or are you seeing the trading window as well? I can see stuff. Uh, what weapons have we currently got equipped? Because these guys have a couple of bolt-action rifles as well as a dart gun. I have nothing. You have an auto pistol. Amelia mm -hmm. has an auto pistol. Esther has nothing. Bulletin has nothing. Maybe I'll just buy one of the bolt-action rifles then? Unless you want to have a dart gun so that you've got a um, a non-lethal takedown weapon? Sure. They're pretty expensive though. It's 848. <clears throat> so maybe not. Yeah. You're not worried either way? Yep. Okay. Dead panther over there. Done. What gun is this? Normal. Normal. Gonna end up. Oh, it's in the river. Great. Why did you dump the gun in the river, you jerks? So wet. Yeah, it's ta it's already taken two percent of the thing off it. <sighs> hey, but Willerton's got a shooting frenzy. Well, I'm gonna give Willerton a gun. Oh, good. I mean, he has only one hand, so he's probably gonna be pretty terrible with it, but. Slowly, slowly building things. Let's get some beds built. I really want to go to three times speed, but I think it causes the desyncs. Uh, yes. That's, <laughs> there's so much patience required right now. So much. Um, Pendragon, I'm not sure that the raiders actually do go for your cooling. They go for an object on the outside of your base. Um, I don't think they specifically target cooling, because I've, I've certainly had lots of situations where the cooling's been relatively nearby, but they've targeted something else because it was closer. You definitely do protect your stuff by just having walls in general all the way around, because then pathing to anything becomes much more difficult. Um, and they'll attack your walls instead, but I don't know that it's specifically. It would be nice if they 
focus things that made some kind of sense. Yeah, but that's not how RimWorld works with this stuff. Because a lot of the stuff gets manipulated to um, mess with tactics that are exploitative. Whatever that means. Yeah. Whatever Tynan wants it to mean. Oh, don't bring the ankylosaurs into the dining room. <laughs> Jeez, how many of the compies did you sell? You were training those. So what? Now we're not. If we get attacked, we're not going to have as many <laughs> attack birds. We'll be fine-ish. They'll, they'll, their numbers will go up quickly again, don't worry. Hey, thanks, Jack Slope. Thank you for continuing your gift sub from Swifty. Um, so you're... Oh, you were collecting the steel so that you can get the concrete built for the wind pump. We got heaps of steel collected. I mean, the wind pump is working and the water tower is filling, uh, yep. but we're going to need a proper toilet. Uh, these are fine. They they get plumbed up. They do, but they don't seem to work. Oh, we can't make proper toilets. Uh, we don't have, like, an outflow yet. Can move the water tubs. Place them with basins. Well, I mean, it won't work until we have the outflow. Uh, the basin should still work. Um, I don't know that it does because it requires flow going through it as well. Slowly making progress on the build, though. Man, it'll be nice when Wallerton's <laughs> grown up and can help with the building. Ugh. Hunting this time. Monkeys. Compies have gotten themselves a meal of monkey. All plants. I think we're on the... I think I might have gone a bit too hard on getting rid of the food. From old made sense, it would be predictable. If it were predictable, you would be able to figure out when it, figure out winning strategies. And if there were winning strategies, Tynan's, Tynan will change it. Sense leads to logic. Logic leads to Tynan hate. Tynan hate leads to suffering. Yeah, something like that. It's it's a fascinating discussion for me because it's something that I think about. I've thought about a lot with making like the ACS mod and how much I do or don't want to limit player behaviors with it and 
eventually came to the conclusion that the lazy strategy is actually, in a lot of ways, the optimal strategy. Because players who want one day on any... Because player, players' opinions around these things change from day to day. Oh, we got a self-tamed compy. How delightful. Yay. There you go. You got to name it. It's got to be something appropriate for having it been self-tamed. Uh, we don't need piping all through the bedrooms. But I need to get round to the other side of them anyway. What are you doing? That. It's going straight through. That's not going to be a bedroom for long. The wall for the other bedroom is coming down there, so it'll be following the wall. Otherwise, you're... Uh, yeah, you're just doing a whole bunch of extra for no reason. So where's the outlet pipe? You're going to push it right on the outside of the map? I was going to put it down here. Because it can go right on the outside. Uh, ish. Put it like there. Sure. Oh. More monkeys getting... <coughs> More monkeys getting eaten. Oh. Kentrosaurus and Carithosaurus. Kentrosaurus, they're pretty cool. Uh, we do have a reformation point. That's true, actually. Come back, do we want to discuss some things about reforming our ideal religion? Uh, what are our options? So if I click reform, we can change the structure. Oh, never mind. Bed hunting pack of yinlongs. There are five of them. Eh, yeah, compies will get them. Uh, only if we recruit our people. Because they will only defend Esther. If she's recruited. Do we want to hide and just let them come closer first? Uh, sure. Oh boy. Wanted prisoners. Fol Galasar, Duchess of the Fallen Empire, seeks her help. Galasar's royal archaeologist recently extracted two prisoners from an ancient crypto sleep vault and intend to question them. To keep the prisoners secret from court rivals, Galasar wants you to hold them for 16 days. Yeah. Uh, they, they can't walk and must be kept in bed. Uh, yeah. Locust armor. Variant of recon armor with an integrated burst rocket for short range flight. 16 days for us to keep them alive. In a prison cell. And yeah. they can't walk. It doesn't yeah. sound that hard for flying armor. Let, let's just get through the man-hunting yinlongs. Um, I'm not sure if we want to wait them out now or if we do want to fight them. I feel like we will get hurt. And I don't know how effective our compies will be. And we do have six that will help. Uh, 
How much? Ah, give me just one of them. Uh, can't we just eat one? Or is it attacking 2,000 liters? One leaders? of them is attacking 2,000 liters. Oh, that's not going to end well for it. Except the 2,000 liters is missing a lot. this Yinlong not dead yet oh before the compies weren't just sleeping <laughs> yeah huh I'm gonna try something that the compies to attack Oh, they're fighting! The compies are fighting! Oh no, why'd Amelia go out that door? Well. That, that makes no sense. What are you doing, Amelia? Ugh. Right. Amelia just lost left arm. Oh, no, that's old. Uh, Willitons has run off and is now getting eaten by dinosaurs. What are they running at? What is... Urgh. They're not... It's... <sighs> the hiding area does not have any area that is disconnected from this area. There is no reason they should go through those doors. They, they're not allowed to go through that. Something is very broken. It's gonna die. Great. This way. Amelia's downed. You're downed. Bulletin's downed. Is this the end? I don't know why the compies are struggling so hard against these things. They should be tearing them to little bitty pieces. I think. Come on, can you deselect that for a sec? Ooh. I think they're all dead or downed. Lutzen has two hours. How long does Kachala have? 19 hours, great. Um, Okay, so you've got five hours, wollaton has got two hours, Amelia's got seven hours, Esther's fine. All right. Of course. Esther the one who caused all these problems in the first place. No, no, Amelia caused the problems. Amelia went out the door first. No, Esther went out the door. No. I'm going to self-tend first.
Uh, Esther's still getting attacked by a dinosaur. What? Isn't it down? No, it's chasing her around. Oh. How does a brachiosaur get its jaw cracked by a yinlong? That make no sense. I don't know. <laughs> oh, Woolerton lost a leg. I did the self-tend first rather than tending Wollerton first because if Kachata keeps bleeding out, Kachata will collapse and then everybody's dead anyway. Is Esther fine now? Can you um, de-recruit Esther whenever she's not under attack? Yes, Wollerton is now missing two limbs. Right shoulder and left leg. Uh... I've got three hours. Amelia's got five hours. Bulletin's still got two hours. One hour. Four hours. Uh, we might have to tend without medicine. Uh, we do have some regular medicine in storage. Three. I think, I think Tatonga's the next one. To Tonga, then Amelia, then back to Woolerton again. Did I only pick up one? One. Uh, you Jumping. know, you know, you have your super healing power as well. Yeah, that's more of wh whoever gets infected first. And Esther medical, um, yeah, actually quite well. Self tend. Oh. And yes, there are herbal meds right next to Tatonga. I should pick those up after these ones run out. Go back. Can you, as soon as... Can you mind Esther? And as soon as she's got this tent done, can you... Uh... That's alright, I'll do it. I can't explain what I'm trying to do. Big Bird and Mashed Potato Joe. You are dead in one hour. Good. You lost your left leg. You're now double peg leg. I'm bleeding out in nine hours now. Yep. Amelia's in three. Yep. Let's draw get Amelia in, in a two. second. Oh boy. Is 
It's a lot of blood. Yeah. Uh, two hours, nine hours. I'm going to have to eat in a sec. Kachada's going to have to eat in a second. Alright, Wollerton's stable health, so... Consume that meal. Oh, don't run to the table, just eat where you are! Will I eat while recruited? Yes. Bleeding out in two hours, Esther twelve hours, Wollerton stable, Tatonga eight hours, Kachada ten hours. So much for getting my plumbing done. Yeah. If if we survive this, I will be very impressed. Esther collapsed. No! Ooh. Curse you and your dementia! Well, 2,000 litres is dying now. Well, Even though they weren't before. Yeah, it's a thing that happens as they catch up to how much they're bleeding from their tiny wounds. Who's got the infection? Amelia. Great. I think Amelia's dead. Because Esther failed at the, he at the tent. Point six hours, point five, point eight. Why are you using the herbal medicine instead of good medicine? Because I picked up the herbal medicine. It's what I've got. I don't have time to go get the good medicine. Using what's at hand. Point three. Nine, eight, seven, six, point five hours. Ten without medicine. Point four. Ten seconds. No, nope. Amelia's dead. Oh, why, Esther? Why? Everybody is dead, Dave. Esther, you useless! <laughs> so frustrating. Well, how, you're bleeding out in five hours. Great. Well, you know what, Esther? Deal with it. I'm picking up medicine and I'm going to... Taking Kachata. Going to tend to, to Tonga. Well, another colony bites the dust. Not yet. But close. Tonga is infected. Yep. At least you're stable now. What? Morg just died, Froggy B just died. Morg and Froggy B.
Honestly, Esther, I don't care about you. <laughs> Esther's just a problem. Not a very nice thing to say. Um. After she chatted with you about making raincoats. That's probably because she thinks it's raining. There goes Tweety. Esther's infected. Yep. I just did a 0% quality tend. Yep. It's not the first one I've seen today and it won't be the last. You detected a farming worksite nearby, controlled by the kinship of the tyrannical vole. Uh... I want to join the kinship of the tyrannical vole. Uh -huh. Sounds amazing. Yep, I mean, Kampak, your red painting did happen. Not where you wanted it, but it happened. Yep. Yeah, Esther's going to die to her infection. You might as well. I mean, game over, man. Oh, I shouldn't have stopped that recreation. That was a mistake. <sighs> I still don't understand why they went outside the door then. It's... They just didn't want to live anymore. Yeah, it shouldn't have happened. Didn't, didn't want to be part of this horrible jungle hellscape. Thanks, Wildozer. Um, yeah, I probably should use the Council for help, Health, Preach Health to Tatonga. But Tatonga needs to be awake for me to preach health to him. Uh, I... I'll be back in a sec. Yep. Tonga cannot walk, so I can't recruit to Tonga, which means I can't do the preach health. Delightful. Uh. Oh dear. I'm back. Did we get raided while I was gone? No, but Mara did post something cool in the IRL creations. Previous timeline, Bill Kerman trapped on Minmus, far from his own reality. 
after hopping in the rover control seat as he watches some cross-shaped craft approach on the minty green rock. That's awesome. The alternate timeline one that exploded. No man in black yet? Nope. Uh, why are we... Why are we not... What's happening? Yes. Oh, there goes bandwagon. Oh, 2,000 liters has healed themselves. Um, we've lost almost all of the Comsognathus. Only Catnip and Steve Rogers. Yeah, left. and then non breeding pair. And Esther's dead. Yep. And there's a storm. <laughs> and the storm is over. And T Tonga just died. Well. Yep, that's colony over. Um, <clears throat> Wollerton, are you mobile yet? No, you're not. Dang it. I need you to be mobile. Actually, you know oh, what? That's a lot of fire. Yeah, it is. Wait, did we have a regen stuff? We did have a regen thing. Can I get Tatonga back? Don't we? Didn't we get a, a regenerative serum thing? There's a healer mech serum. Yeah, where is it? There it is. How do I use it on you? Is it an operation? Anyone, how how do you use the healer mech serum? Oh, there are some compsognathus eggs. The, I believe that a, a healer mech serum can resurrect the dead if it unlo undoes the thing that caused the death. I thought it could do that. I thought it could be used that way. It does not. Yeah. Alright, back to the fire I go. As Kapak enjoys whatever he's eating. Oh, Jesus. You couldn't wait for the colony to die before you started stuffing your face with Maltesers? That's the best time. And crinkling the wrapper in front of the microphone? Yeah. Why do you keep pausing it? Stop pausing it! Yes, put out those fires with your gun. Mm -hmm. There we go. You can deselect Kachata. 
he hasn't got long. Oh, I think I just got a screenshot for a this is fine thumbnail. Yep. <laughs> This is too slow. Um, I know how to end this. Oh no, there's no T-Rex. There is a small group of compies though. Hang on. Oh, they just... Just escaped. Come on, fight back. Fight back, you little jerk. Fight back. There we go. Man in black. Come back. Um, Nikosi. Deal with Nikosi. Wait, who's Ogen? The, who's Georgian and Lalo? <laughs> what? I accepted all the quests we had. <laughs> For random people. <sighs> what? You're up. All right. Well, I'm calling that the end. Wait, can I? Do we have anything that we can set things on fire with? Oh, nope. Down again. What am I doing with- oh, fighting a Mega Neura. I don't know why it's so hard to kill the last of the colony. It's always the weirdest thing that always takes so long to do in the very end. It's like the game goes, no, 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 no. And I don't know why Kapak keeps pausing it. Does Kapak know why he keeps pausing it? Because uh, the game pauses itself sometimes. Game doesn't want it to end. There you go. Bulletin's the only one who's not dying. Well, you say that. But his malnutrition is severe. Uh, he's not going to regain consciousness. So he's going to starve. Which art has three hours. Derp, derp, derp. And this fire is consuming the whole map. Yeah, I'm surprised it hasn't started raining. Normally it does for performance reasons. I if it'll cross the river. There we go, Kachata died. Cozy dies in two hours. Wollerton's gonna die shortly. Okay, Nikosi's down. It's a lot of fire. Oh. 
Oh, yeah. Now the rain comes. All because Amelia wanted to go outside and check on things. Stupid Amelia. No wonder you were the first to die. Oh, there's a mad monkey! <laughs> How delightful! True, 2,000 litres did survive. That's the important part. Bah -bah. And that is the colony over. We did do better than our first attempt on this no, mindset. That's fine. 2,000 litres will be the boss now. <laughs> Alright. Uh, before we leave, we can imagine that the Brachiosaurus now has access to everywhere. There we go. <sighs> well, Kabak, since you said you had things to do, shall we wrap up there? Uh, on that fail. And we can think about what we might want to do if we want to come back for some more RimWorld next week. Yeah, I got the multi off. Yep, I think that's what we're going to do. Uh, I'll be back on Thursday morning with some Valheim. Uh, we're going to be fighting Yagleth. I... We'll probably be back on Friday as well with some space engineers since they've got the beta update. So expect some space engineers here on Twitch. Um, which should be some fun. Messing around with some of the new stuff. Thinking about tutorializing it and trying to record something. Um, so I'll Probably just stream until I feel like I've got a handle on the blocks and what we've got access to and that stuff. And then I'll do some recording in the afternoon and try and edit something to put out on the weekend. Capac uh, uh, will be back on Thursday with... What are you doing Thursday evening? Uh, so... Not sure if the timing's right. I think I'll be doing more Crisis Core. Okay. Um, but it's probably a bit early for me to wrap up the stream, so I might do a couple of Dark Tides. Alrighty, so Capac's going to continue, so I'll go raid Capac. I'm going to wrap up here and go and do some more editing of Assertive Acquisitions. Uh, so yeah, Valheim tomorrow, Space Engineers Friday. Capac now. Bye, everybody. <laughs>